do you have young kids and they're just starting out and yeah, go-karts motorbikes atvs well i have purchased this little module alarm kill starter it's got everything on there you can uh, pretty well electric start if it, it's got a starter motor by a remote uh, you can also set an alarm on it if you want apparently it's really loud um, but I am using this for my son for his little dirt cart my son's not even three yet um, I had a rope tied to the back uh, for his first go but I sort of wanted to you know let him sort of be free a little bit but we got a little dirt track out the back and I thought because I know go-kart centers and stuff have them um, remote kills so I thought oh, I'll research and look one up so found it it was cheap eBay 20 bucks and I'm just going through I'm gonna uh, label what all these wires are and um, I'm manning a will Milwaukee battery you can buy these off eBay as well $15 so it needs power supply so you just click that in there have your power supply then you can kill the ignition so i'm going to get through all this simplify it and if you um, are interested uh, these are perfect for kids so um, you can just if, if you see they're in trouble you just hit that button and it'll kill the ignition so um yeah you gotta look gotta look after that's my little boy eh? <laughs> So uh, I'm gonna get stuck into this wiring and simplify it for you. All right guys, so this is our little remote. Um, this has got a little bit more juice than uh, 12 volts, but seems to work. You can hear it clicking. It's all the functions, so. Seems to be working. Just need to figure out what wires are which, because the the diagram that they give um, it's not very clear so and a lot of other videos out there all the wirings in different order so um, yeah I just have to go through it from from the start but gotta go through all them because they all do different things uh, you know for cars indicators um, and then also your kill your ignition and then your starter and then obviously your red and black power and it was meant to have an antenna on here I don't know if that little black one's the antenna or not but on other modules they're a lot bigger antenna so I'm pretty sure that black one's an antenna you got a little fuse there as well so um, yeah I'll figure it out your pink wire your pink wire is your kill okay and also the grey so if you had just one of them, the gray or the pink, connected to, if you have like a little kill switch up here, I'll put a little uh, dual one on here, dual connector. So we went to our ignition with the pink or the gray singly. When it was running and I hit the unlock, it would flick the relay only for a couple of seconds. So when it's at idle it will kill the ignition the it'll cut the motor but under acceleration which you know when a young kid or someone unexperienced is holding it flat out and you hit the kill the engine the engine doesn't um it, it's still running so it kills the ignition for only a couple of seconds then it it triggers it and the ignition comes back on the piston's running and then it fires back up. So what I had to do was run the gray wire, which was either pink or gray. I run the, the gray wire to the earth. So I've got my Milwaukee battery, ground chassis, then also the black wire from the unit, ground as well, plus the gray wire ground. And then what that does is then I'll have the pink wire hooked up to the ignition and what it does is it locks the ignition the whole time so at the moment if that was all plugged in the ignition would be off so try pull start it it won't start so 
So I've got to hit this ignition button twice, then that unlocks the ignition. Then I can start it, and then you hit the unlock to trigger the relay, and that'll just trigger it once, so then that, that kills the whole engine, everything. Accessories, engine, whatever you got, it'll kill the whole lot. Okay, so there's a sequence, and that's what took me a while to figure out, so yeah. Because otherwise, if it was only one wire hooked, I would have had to keep pressing off, 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 off for it to actually kill the go-kart. So there was a little bit of mucking around, but that's why I'm doing this and putting this video up. Now, this isn't a car, so it doesn't have, um, you know, turn signals and horns and accessories and lights and all that jazz. So I'm only, I've only gotten deep enough to figure out how to kill the ignition. Um, on a you know go-kart motorbike ATV that is an electric start this isn't an electric electric start you can hook this up to start with electric start so just a press of a button and start it but I just need to know how to kill the engine on a go-kart so you do need a power supply I was a bit worried about running the Milwaukee because I think they're 18 volt not sure I, I'm not an electrician. My young fella's only three in a couple of months, so um, he, he's not even toilet trained yet. Um, he can barely put a sentence together, so, but he can drive. He knows how to go, he knows how to stop, but just a, a more safety, you know, for me. And then I can sit down under the tree in the shade and just watch him and mum, mum will have one of these too. There's two, so we can both, you know, if we miss something or one or the other, we can both, boom, hit the button. My young fella's flat out on the track, he's not slowing down. I hit that unlock, boom. Kills the whole thing. How good is that? Good thing about this, you can just charge it up before your kid goes for a drive. Plug it in. That module there, with all the relays and stuff, um, is activated. Get the key. So I've just neatened it all up, all my wiring, set it there. This is that little black one's the antenna, just set it up there. And that pink wire I had to extend, so it's green now. Run it all up to the positive for the ignition. You've got your earth, and um, yeah, that should be on now. So we've got to do the sequence where we've got to put that twice. The ignition should be on. the unlock and kills it all right guys thanks for watching this video if you haven't done so already please like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one peace out